Hello everyone and welcome back to another part of Let's Play Eador, Masters of the Broken World on Overlord Difficulty. In this part I'll just continue with the leveling. Uh, I would like to, to clear as many locations as possible and um, I've decided that um, except of uh, the remaining provinces we have in Terrian Wood, I will also visit some of these shops that are available uh, on our western borders and then I will head west and probably uh, try to get to Daryl through these uh, Orcish tribes. Um, maybe we are, uh, we may have some good targets in uh, Dream Pools. Uh, that's where our scout is heading. So in case there is something really, really tempting and juicy, I may make a short uh, stop there. But uh, I'm kind of curious what uh, uh, what Daryl is doing. So I will try to get to him. Uh, as fast as possible once we are done uh, on the western side of the of the kingdom. Okay, so let's start. Uh, first, uh, we have these bandits. Sure, why not? Why do we have this? Our gear look like maybe I could sell some of this stuff because that really is just trash. Repair the gear. Mm, flaming bow with fire arrows seems fine for this fight. And the rituals, I don't think that we need anything. And what is our warrior doing? Oh, uh, we still need to check, I think, the last location to know what uh, exactly is there. Okay, so I'll do just that and then I will send him to Dream Pools to help with uh, explorations. And I think we can finally start playing. Um, mm -hmm. No catapult. This should be easy. Okay, start. Without sabotage, of course. Um, and move down. First, kill that ballista. And next. Okay, one, two, three. That's another unit down. You can do some damage to this guy, and I should probably start working on the executioner. Hmm. What are my options? Let's let's send one bolt to that assassin. You guys will do some damage to the executioner, and I will kill the bowman. Next. Hmm. Uh, what now? Kill the thief. Kill the brigand and you can hit only that executioner so we'll just do that. That's the same thing with these guys. And one, two, Three. Okay, he's down. Do you have crushing blow? You don't. Let's well, just block his path and focus on the assassin. Okay, this works. And let's finish this quickly. And what I'll do, I'll actually um, try to give as many last hits to my units now, uh, because I need them to level uh, actually now faster than the hero. Even though we don't have some skills I'd like to have on the hero, it's more important to get that extra range for our crossbows than some uh, extra damage on the hero. I'll try to increase my chance by giving my units some last hits. 
Okay, let's see. Anything interesting after this fight? Uh, I guess survivability. You have seven seven uh, shots. I think one one more, two more is fine. Uh, morale for this guy, no range, of course. And what about the loot? That's trash. Okay, but we are doing this for experience, so it doesn't really matter. Um, okay, this is what I wanted to know. There is a ghost, so I will have to swap to uh, Ethereal Crossbow for this fight. And here... <laughs> I'll just burn the witch. And... Yeah, we have enough gold, so let's just uh, give them something so we uh, avoid uh, uh, the second event that would pop up eventually if we don't bury the, those corpses. Uh, you'll start exploring. Our warrior will join you eventually. That will take quite a while for him to get there. And what else do we have? I don't want to attack uh, the wild Pegasi. Undead are these undead are too weak to be worth uh, attacking. Droids I'll pass. So I guess lizard man. These battle mages are tier two, so I'll pass on them as well. That's not worth doing. And then we'll attack this undead. Yeah, it looks like a lot of targets, but um, we actually have only two that I want to do. Um, so let's start with uh, lizard man, and I will use. The Chalice of Life have taken some damage. So let's make sure everyone is healed. Sell these items, repair the gear, and for this fight, uh, the bow we have is fine. Okay, next. Mm, this looks easy enough. Okay, where are they? Uh, without sabotage and hmm. I'll definitely need some extra firepower up here. I actually like to kill the priest first, if possible. No, of course not. But with three hit points, you shouldn't be able to do anything. Okay, who can shoot now? <laughs> One, two, three. Now. And I will quickly check movement. No, nothing can get to me yet. Um. One, two, three. And you guys... I'll do as much damage as possible to the turtle back. Good. What else? Let's maybe do some damage to those medusas. But now, I guess this basilisk needs to die. Okay, he's down. Good. You can reach only the other basilisk, and okay, that's it for this turn. But next turn we should be able to maybe even clear all of this. Okay, Basilisk first. Now the hero will kill the Medusa. And finish the rest. Easy. Okay, some more experience and again, let's hope for extra range. This is not bad. Two hit points, that counts. Uh, you still could use some more ammo. Definitely when it's against counter attack. And no range. Oh, well. Well, I'm not su not surprised. 
Uh, Ogre Mask is so uh, crap. We will keep exploring and what's this? Oh, hire assassin as always. And it worked. Okay, next will be undead, so let's uh, swap the weapon. And maybe uh, the wizard's hat is not that useful anymore. Um, maybe the regeneration from the ogre mask isn't that bad, actually. Yeah, let's grab that. I don't really care that much about the hero now, and the 5% really is not a huge difference. And the regeneration actually could, uh, could help. Also, plus 6 hit points. The hero is the only tank we have, so let's give him some more survivability. Anything else? I uh, don't think so. Okay. Repair. I'll keep the hat, just in case. And attack the undead. Okay, you'll keep exploring. Um, shall I help? Help the warrior get there. How long did it take? Eight turns to get uh, Ferens again. Let me count. One turn for the fight. Two. Uh, what's here? Oh, these are dwarves. I'll pass in this shop. I don't want to fight uh, siege weapons in mountains. That's uh, way too risky. So I'll probably need two turns to get to Shattered Hills. Yeah, that's right in you. One, two, three, four. That's the fight. Five will be to get to Hound Steps. Six for the shop. I would like to try the Cult of the Hydra. So that will be that would be seven. And um, hmm. Then one turn to just move, maybe to the capital. That would be awesome. And then we would have the ritual available to get all the way to Dream Pools. I think I can use it now. Let's do it. Uh, that should uh, speed things up quite a lot by like four turns for the warrior. Okay. And do you need anything? Just attack, I guess. Go. We know what to expect. So I'll just do this as fast as possible. Can I one-shot the ghosts? I may. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Oh, that's another ghoul. Kill the skeleton if possible. And I would say one more turn. Oh. There we go. Okay, again. Uh, oh, no level ups, so no disappointment this time. And another witch. What do you want to do with her? Just to burn her, I guess. Oh! A demon invasion. So I just lost the province. Well, I want to go there anyway, so whatever. Happens, I guess. Um, okay, we are done in this province. Can I get there in one turn? I can't. So it will be as I expected. Okay, next turn. Maybe I should keep an eye on uh, on my borders actually. Every turn just check in case Daryl breaks through one of these provinces. Would be 
I uh, good to know, I guess. Uh, keep exploring. What's this? Rain of Frogs. Wow. Stupid superstitions. And delegation of elves. Elves decided to visit me. Um, what do they want? I actually am not. I'm not quite familiar with this event. That's uh, something I don't have that often. Um, day of mourning. Demand this day to be honored across the whole empire with a period of uh, contemplation and silence. Um, execute the ambassadors. I guess that's the only right thing to do with elves. They became angry. So sad. Uh, 116 gold. Eliminate elf rebels. There we go. That's the only way how to how to work with elves. And we have to have the gold back. Okay, good. Now does it look, look like with the population mood? It only dropped to discontent. Well, it wasn't that bad. I expected they will be now furious. Okay, warrior needs one more turn, and we will uh, reconquer our province. And this is a real demon army of four imps. Um. Okay, can we kill all of this? I guess we can. Good. Wow, and the level up for the hero from this. Seriously? Uh, but the uh, but the really, really crappy one is the only useful thing is the scouting. Well, wow, that's trash. Okay, keep exploring. Uh, what's this? Why are they attacking? Come on. Uh, 300 gold. Yeah, whatever. At this point, I don't really care about the gold that much. But um, off camera, I'm playing on a custom shark, and there I'm playing as uh, on a good side. And I have to say the difference when you compare the amount of good and uh, and bad events you're getting when you are you know playing good and evil, that's just insane. Uh, I probably don't get. Uh, that many events through uh, throughout the whole shard as good as I'm getting in like five turns as evil, crazy. But well, we decided to go evil, so there have to be at least some challenges. We are we are free to uh, plunder our lands and get gold from from almost all events, so it has to be balanced at uh, at some way. Okay, now back to fighting. Retinue. It should be able to do this, but last time we fought Retinue, we lost the unit, so hopefully now our damage is better and we'll be able to kill them before they get to us. Uh, any rituals? Still two turns for Illusionary Battle. And we'll start exploring. Okay, this looks good. Nothing unexpected there. And the terrain is good, I would say. A lot of hills that should uh, slow them down. And we have some hills as well for the extra range, so that's good. Uh, we don't need any sabotage or anything. Okay, now, can the horseman get to me in one move? Nope, he can't. What about the war elephant? One, two, 
Okay, so on turn 3 I'll probably have to web him. I have two turns to get rid of the knight and the horseman. And hopefully uh, range units as well. And then I can web the elephant and kill him. That sounds like a plan. Okay, I need the hero... Where? I'd say on this tile. Kill the bowman first. <laughs> you can do some damage already. Good. Oh, this is gonna hurt. At least that uh, elephant can't get to me. Well, what now? Make sure that everything else around the hero dies. I think I'll need some help with the knight from the hero. So let's attack him. And now... Oh, still needs a lot of hits. Okay. At least three, three shots for the elephant. Next. Now... That's the time for the first web. I actually need more than one. Uh, to the south, I can clear all of this, I guess. Um, maybe these guys will focus on the guardsman. He is uh, a lot more dangerous. Come on, kill him finally. <laughs> one hit point. Well, I guess um, at one hit point I can let him be. And next. Okay, finish off all of this. Uh, can I do something with that crossbowman? You can attack him. Anyone else? I don't. Oh, you can. Perfect. And I'll just play this safe. Web that elephant again. If I helped uh, with the hero, I would probably be able to kill him. But I'd rather uh, give my crossbows a chance to shoot twice that gives them more experience uh, yep finish him off and finish him off with crossbowman good that was smooth 267 gold but that's not as important uh, important is uh, our experience and level ups we should get one two maybe four five let's see uh, well ranged attack is fine survivability and no wrench again the, this is really frustrating now what about the loot? cloak of whirlwinds um, well nothing amazing I'll just check the cloak I don't remember what I'm using now uh, hey knowledge store that might be something where it uh, with it uh, with the uh, with the commander, of course, for more experience. Uh, defended by battle mages, or maybe not. Uh, definitely don't want to fight the uh, phoenix. Oh, well, never mind. Uh, I was hoping that they'll be guarded by gargoyles. These shops are often guarded by an uh, army of sixteen gargoyles, and that's amazing source of experience. But well, no luck. Well, where is our cloak? 
one melee defense plus two hit points compared to melee defense and stamina. I think I'll stick to the veteran's cloak. Gloves. Uh, let me check my. Uh, I mean, swap my weapons. Okay. Now, you could use some healing and let's build a storehouse to get rid of all of this. Uh, these two. Uh, repair the gear again and move down. Okay, you guys will keep exploring. And begin another turn. Going. Oh, anything interesting? Inquisitors. Uh, yeah, these were here before, but I may try them actually. Slugs that should be doable undead. That will most likely be a vampire. But we might be able to do it. Adventures. Oh, that's doable, but probably not worth it. Mm. Uh, I don't think there is enough targets yet, but maybe we'll see. If I'm really desperate and we, we don't get a single uh, ranged level up, and I may have to go there. Okay, another retinue. This time might be more challenging because uh, it's on planes. So I'll have to be more careful. Maybe let's actually use Illusionary Battle first. Uh, maybe you'll get some more level ups. Yep, and the crappy one again. Uh, <laughs> which one? I guess range defense. And then the turn. It should be the same army. So I'll try to do it the same way as before. Actually, there are some obstacles. Okay. Let's see. Uh, as usual, Bowman standing on the hill, so I have to kill him first. Um, mm -hmm. The horseman can't get to me in one move, that's good. I guess I can stand here, I don't have to go closer. Finish the... come on. Kill the bowman. If I had that extra range, the whole first line would be able to shoot already, and that's a difference of how much. Uh, like, 100 damage. That's just insane. Okay. Uh, kill the horseman. You can kill the uh, kill. You can hit that elephant. What else? I don't like the knight at all. Because he'll most likely end up on the hill, and then he will have uh, uh, these three tiles for his charge. But I don't think I'll be able to kill him. Maybe I'll have to move some units closer. Something like this to be ready for him. And. I'll have to do some damage. Okay, this should be enough. Next. Because from now on, I can't use the hero anymore for shooting. I just have to keep the elephant webbed. So. 
how can we do this? These guys can only hit that elephant. So let's do just that. What about you? It's the same. Okay. And now you can hit the knight. Same for you. And you as well. Okay. The knight is dead. Do some damage to the pikemen. They don't have forced march, so that makes it a bit easier. Kill swordsman and focus on the guardsmen. I guess that's the best thing I can do now. Okay, first of all, make sure that the elephant stays uh, wrapped. Kill everything that is uh, too close. And these guys... I'll just focus on that elephant. He will die eventually. Okay, can I kill him already? I should have more than enough damage for him. Good. Kill the pikeman and hero will kill the crossbowman. Easy. Okay, good. And again. Fingers crossed, we need that range. I know that I'm repeating this uh, over and over again, but it's crucial. Um, uh, ranged attack, hit points, ranged attack. There we go, at least one. Finally, this is the level up I want. Definitely want to take it. Uh, for this guy, it will be a ranged defense, I guess. Ranged attack. That was quite decent. Finally, at least one guy has that range, but uh, uh, almost. Uh, all of the remaining level ups were extra range damage, so that uh, definitely counts as well. And the loot we have um, Belt of Valor, Monk's Belt, nothing too amazing. Yeah, I'll just sell this, I'll just check what belt we have just in case. Okay, keep exploring. Same for you. Uh, build me. Oh, I can't build storehouse. Why do I have a granary here? Oh. What? I can't demolish that? Or. Why can't I demolish the granary? That's weird. Well, then I will uh, demolish the pub. Because, um, uh, not this. I want, um, I want storehouse. Okay, where is our belt? Um, Druid's belt. Stamina and forest knowledge. Hmm, I guess the forest knowledge is still quite important, so we can move uh, around with the hero. Even in forest, uh, I do it almost uh, in every battle that I move the hero closer. I guess I'll keep it. But maybe uh, if we get the level up with forest knowledge, which is possible that we'll get, then I would be, uh, wouldn't need this anymore, and the belt of ore would be an upgrade, so I'll keep it and sell just these. Okay, repair. And I think we can try the cult. Everyone is set full health, hero has 80 hit points. So he can even like take one uh, one attack from the Hydra. 
and we should be hitting hard enough to uh, make the Hydra panic and run away, which is the plan. Hmm. But uh, we might need uh, the debuff from Heavy Arrows. Yeah, I think I'll try it. I think it might work. Before I end this part, let's uh, use extra wagons on to calm down those stupid elves. And um Oh, what? Oh, that's a surprise. I expected that um, if Daryl will get to us, it will be through this province, not through Centaurs and uh that's actually quite scary. One, two, three, four, five. That seems to be a fifth ring. And I think it will be at least fifth ring from his capital as well. I think his capital is somewhere around here. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I'd say it's fifth ring as well. And um Centaur is in the fifth ring, that's just the sixteen uh sixteen units uh around level twenty. That's a pretty strong army. Houston we may uh, it might be in trouble. Okay, time for guards. Hmm. The best we have. Um, I will still uh, try that uh, cult. I think it's a lot of experience, and then we just have to move. To at least to have the 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 commander somewhere around here in case um, Daryl decides to attack, I'll be able to defend myself. How does it look like with the fair wind two turns? Yeah. Well, okay, interesting. But I expected it. What's the turn like? Oh, 160. Well, it took him a bit longer than I expected, but um, it's here. And I think now it will be quite interesting. I just hope that we are prepared enough. But we will see about it in the next part. And I hope you will join me for that. And until the next part, have a good time. And bye bye.